What's going on lads? I hope you all had a fantastic Christmas and today we're going to do a review on Yannick Bulassi. Now the Crystal Palace forward has incredible stats on his card or on his inform card. 86 pace, 83 dribbling, 80 physical stats, 71 passing and 66 shot. Now lads don't believe that 66 shot. It's, it's total bullshit. You, when you're when you're in game, it's he's an absolute freak, absolute absolute freak. He seems like a tank. He seems like a total destroys the Ramoses. He, he destroys the Thiago Silvers. He destroys all the he destroys all the uh, all the Hummels. He destroys all the Boatangs. He just tank. He he just rips through all of the goal players. Uh, you know, just absolute demolishes them. Anyway, let's go on to game stats. Now, as you can see, lads, 80 aggression, 87 acceleration. Now, well, don't believe that. He feels like he's 95 pace, people. He feels absolute amazing. 85 agility, 74 balance, 86 sprint speed, 81 stamina, and 81 strength. Incredible. He's also got 86 dribbling. Which is just unbelievable. You will not see an 86 dribbling on any other silver card. That isn't a crazy, crazy, crazy start for a silver. 80 crossing, 70 up ball control, not too bad. Long shots, 64. And finishing, 62. But he feels like it's an 80 shot. Where to start with Yannick Bolassi? Now he's passing... His strength, his positioning, are all just fantastic. Now, as you can see in this clip, that pass to Sturridge, so perfectly timed, with his weaker foot as well, found the gap and executed it so perfectly. Now, in this clip here, he loses the ball, but immediately gets back in position on his weak foot, scores first time. Now... Honestly, I did have a few problems with his finishing. Inside the box, he wasn't the most clinicalest finishers you would you would sort of play with in FIFA. Uh, he, probably six times out of ten, he would probably finish inside the area. He's not too too clinical. He's not the best best finisher at all. Um, his long shots are are a big letdown as well. Um, he probably might score. Out of ten shots with him, maybe two long shots with him, and uh, you know, just very, very hard to score with his long shots. Um, his shot power, it doesn't feel like seventy four; it feels like an eighty eight shot power. Is it's just incredible his shot power. Um, in this clip here to Sanchez, look at that pass! Look at that pass! Uh, beautiful dink to Sanchez, and he just gets it through the legs of Sirigu. Uh His free kick accuracy, it shows uh, fifty three on his uh, in game stats. But this free kick was just so perfectly timed, and and he got it to perfection and, and scored it beautifully. Now, uh, his positioning wasn't the best. He wasn't really when I was attacking with my players. He wasn't there sometimes. He sort of stayed back, and you know he wasn't in the area sometimes when maybe Sturridge or when someone was running with the ball. He wasn't in position all the time, so that's probably one issue to find. But. In this clip here, he, he times it, he's just on side and gets it to the bottom right corner. So that was a beautiful, beautiful uh, time there and a beautiful finish by Blassie. But um, like I said, he's finishing, you might finish about six times out of ten maybe. You know, it's not the best, but honestly guys, <laughs> if you guys are just skillers and if you guys are just all about dribbling and pace, this guy's for you. His dribbling, his pace, his pace honestly feels like he's a 90, 90, 92. Uh, his dribbling in game stats, 86. Just absolutely incredible, incredible stats. Um, you probably won't find a better 86, uh, you know, uh, in game stat silver in the game. Uh, now, like I said, his dribbling, just incredible. And that long shot there absolutely just shows his quality as a silver player. And. And he's just absolutely incredible. But like I said, that was a, a lucky shot in my eyes. You know, just the it was a um yeah, just the not a fluke, but 
yeah, it was a nice shot by Blassie. He just dri he dribbled past everyone and got it in. But like I said, if you guys are all about the pace and all about the dribbling and all about the skill moves, this guy's for sure. He's like a Neymar, honestly. He feels like a Neymar just with the with the with the Ibrahim of his strength and with that just incredible, incredible. Uh, you know, you just can shrug off all the Serge Ramoses, Tiago Silvers, and you name them. But um, uh, what's like I said. He's dribbling. Everything just can get past the player. Shrugs them off. He can just he can just make the defenders fall on the ground, and he is just incredible. But like I said, finishing clinically wise, he's not the best finisher. Uh, I like like I said, he's he's probably the best sword player I ever played with. So, in form, Blassie, guys, just an incredible player. His pace, his dribbling, his passing, his physical stats, just everything about him, just fantastic. I bought him for 185k. I can see his price is going down in a few coming weeks. Um, this guy would suit perfectly in a, in a Silver Bucks Premier League team. And, like I said, he's just the incredible, incredible player. Probably the best Silver player I've ever played with. But if you guys... Could smash a like in the in the box below. That'd be fantastic. And in from Blassie, I give an eight out of ten.